more about what I see online, right? And and what I can. I mean, now I've actually touched an arcade one-up cabinet, you know, in the flesh. I know what the buttons feel like, the controls feel like. But you know, who knows if we'll even see the pinball cabinet down here? The suggestions that we are. I don't think it's going to be until at least quarter one, at least over here. Um, and they may not even do it. They may hold it over till next Christmas. Who knows? You know, yeah. and do wave two. I mean, that's a distinct possibility. Um, so... My my plea for at games at the moment, but my plea also goes out to to arcade one up. Quit marketing just solely to the person that's going to walk by it in the store, the casual fan that's going to read some bullet points and go, oh, oh yeah. Give us hardcore people the information that we want. We want to know what is the actual height of mm, the dimensions. The, yeah, you know, me standing there. What is floor to top of the play field? What is that height? Um, you know, how is the store going to work for purchasing these these tables? Uh, I don't know. There's there's all manner. You know, we were talking about last time how we just want to see DMD or, or, or second monitor and play field interacting at the same time. So yes. that we can under because there's things that we can key into and pick up on that we want to know. You know what are the in terms of with at games. You know what is the ability to just only purely show the score up on the on the monitor, or is it yeah. always going to be baked into to the back glass and you can just like magnify it or something like that? I don't know. These are these are uh, the questions that we need real answers to, and we need them to be answered with video, like that is or video or clear pictures with like measurements and, and, it's, and stuff and it's literally just talk to one of us that and i'm saying just me or jared i'm talking to any of these Anyone content in... creators that are into digital pinball yeah. um because they all we all have the same questions and we're not getting the answers <laughs> which is why you're getting such wild and varied opinions on the internet because when you don't supply hard facts and information people speculate so if you don't want that out there, don't give us the fodder to speculate. Actually give us information and we won't do it. Right? Easy peasy. Sounds good to me. Please and thank you. <laughs> it doesn't seem so hard. I don't know why they're, they're using content providers and, and like content affiliates to do their marketing for them at games. That's the thing I don't understand. And, you know, to be fair, essentially they're getting Mel to do the same thing for... Um, Arcade One Up as well. Yes, but the difference with the content that we've seen from Mel versus At Games is that it's actually content, and he is actually playing the product as you would play it in your home, and that is the big difference. The, the like, Arcade One Up, from that perspective, are well in front of At Games with their ability to communicate the value of the product. Right, um, well in front, and At Games honestly they need to catch up and they need to do it fast and they need to do it officially. 